With the official start of summer right around the corner, many are scrambling to trim down, but they don't always do it the right way. I speak to a local wellness coach and bust some common nutrition and fitness myths. Most people do want to have a quick fix. They want results now. But Hickey says and we like, need to be patient like and stop trying those quick fixes as they have a yo-yo effect. Well. So you lose you weight initially, sure but eventually you start gaining it back. Saying pills, powders, and shakes will not make you thin. While some of them absolutely have a place in a healthy weight management program, some of them are just too extreme. And if you're replacing meals with breakfast, lunch, and dinner shakes, it's not a lifestyle and you just can't maintain it long term. Something else you can't maintain long term, dieting. So there's a difference between dieting and your diet. And in traditional dieting, you're cutting out specific nutrients. Whether it be carbs, fats, or just cutting calories, causing your body to go into starvation mode. And when that happens, the weight that you lose, unfortunately, isn't fat. It's in water weight and muscle, which is the complete opposite of what you actually want. And to get that lean muscle and torch the fat, you'll need to do more than just cardio. Because you end up losing lean muscle. So again, it goes against what we're trying to do. Short bursts of cardio, absolutely fine combined with some resistance training is going to be the best way for you to maximize fat loss. And ditch the thigh reducers, tummy trimmers, and other body part shapers because Hickey says there's no such thing uh, as so spot reducing. Reducers, Doesn't matter how many crunches you do, how many side bends or the thigh masters you do, your body has set points of where it loses fat from. He says the key is to make a lifestyle change. Because we don't just want to look good for this summer, we want to look good for next summer and the summer beyond that. So start thinking long term term, not just short term. You'll get there, just stay consistent. Second myth was pills, powders, and shakes. To make and Hickey recommends finding a good balance of proteins, carbs, and fats, and eating a small meal every two to three hours to rev up your metabolism. And I feel like a lot of people like to do this during the summertime because, you know, everybody's out doing things and you want exactly. to look good. Exactly, beach season, that's so, right. you know, it's important to be patient. That's a big thing, yes. too. There's no quick fix. So. You certainly need patience. Well, still ahead, it's your health. And we'll take a look at some numbers from this year's flu season. Stay with us.